Hey, it's Randy here in the garage. And what I've got in the bike stand is just an old uh, 90s Walmart mountain bike Roadmaster. I just pulled it out of the drainage ditch near our house and somebody dumped it there. I think what I'll do is just strip it of its parts, keep what I think I can use and we'll recycle the rest of it, uh, which would mostly be the frame probably. Uh, this may turn into a build video. I might take uh, whatever parts I pull off of this, I might put them onto another frame and Here's what we'll probably be keeping out of all this. Uh, the wheels and the tires look okay. Not sure about that crank set or the pedals. I may get rid of those. I uh, think I'll keep that derailleur. The brakes, handlebars maybe, the stem I'll keep. Chain, headset, bottom bracket cups. And I think we'll keep this fork just to play around with. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm doing, but I spotted this while I was up in the attic stashing some stuff away. I think it's an old Hawthorne frame. I think I'll play around with it. I know this is sacrilege. I really hate this frame. I just do not like the style of this frame. Now, when you add the tank, like the Zeppelin or something model, I don't know. Then it looks pretty cool, but otherwise, I think it's the goofiest looking. This looks too new and needs to be patinaed to match the rest of the bike. We can take care of that. I was just kind of joking playing with this, but I think I'm going to follow it through and get it right with this fork. Um, I'm going to have to uh, spread the rear triangle though to get this hub to fit in there. Well, surprisingly, everything looks pretty straight in here. With such limited gearing in the back, that may be too big of a sprocket up front.
Okay, I said I wanted to put a little beefier tire on there. We've got the clearance and just for looks mostly. Um, we've got these that will be a little bit wider. I think we'll go with these. Somebody's replaced these tires at some point. Um, these are nice tires and I'll be keeping those. And looky here. Hey, maybe that's why the tubes still held air. How about that? This is a heavy duty tube. <laughs> so that was worth dragging the bike home just for the tires and tubes. I just gave these a quick coat of a kind of an off-white to closer match the frame. We'll probably do some more something to patina the fork. Yeah. Okay, one thing I haven't addressed is rear brakes. I'd really like to have rear brakes. I think I'm running out of old, like, mountain bike caliper brakes, so I'll be lucky to find anything in here. Well, I say that there. Those look like pretty long reach there. That ought to work fine for the brake. I just need to come up with a, a way to to mount it to the fender stay there. And I think I have just the thing. That's off a, a cantilever brake. Okay, I'm gonna have to drill that hole out. Shoot, I should have thought of that before I put the rear wheel on. Okay, what I just didn't film was me mounting this derailleur. And it's the same one I pulled off that bike that we stripped down earlier. Okay, yeah, I grabbed a couple different stems, let's see. I think we'll go a whole different direction here with a, like a BMX stem and these bars that have a little more rise to them. And we'll reuse the brake levers that uh, 
They were on that bike we tore down. Oh, let's see, we're gonna need a shifter for... Okay, just simple friction shifter. Now to get some grips. These are Pedro's black wall. Go about right there. And I think we'll just stop there for the night and maybe pick up where we left off tomorrow. Putting way too much effort and time into this, but I guess it's the journey, not the destination. I think I'll put on the chain next. I think we may go with this whole surface. Pedals.
things. I have a little more wear and tear on them. We'll go with these. Okay, I think that's everything. Now I'll take it for a ride. Just to recap real quick, the frame is a Hawthorne, I believe from the late 30s. Uh, most of the other parts are off that junk bike that I tore down. That includes a 26 inch steel wheels, a six speed. The derailleur is also off that bike. I put on a different crank and aluminum pedals. Put on the caliper brake, this little surface seat that I had, a BMX stem, these handlebars have a little bit of rise and swept back, Pedro's grips, a thumb friction shifter, the brake levers off that old junk bike, as well as the uh, front fork and brake. I don't know if you can see that, Hawthorne. Tires I had in their Duro Rocky Wolf 26 by 2.1 and a zip tied on a water bottle cage. Ain't she a beaut? It rides about how it looks. <laughs>